My name is Mike Rose and I am the Scheme Coordinator for the Animal Science Scheme at Aberystwyth University. The scheme is about the animals that are used by man. So we're talking about farm animals, um, horses, companion animals and zoo animals and also laboratory animals as well. There is choice in terms of um, the, the type of animal that you study and, and also the aspects of, in terms of health or, or nutrition and, and so on as well. We have an awful lot of, uh, of laboratories at Aberystwyth University. We, we spent millions of pounds in upgrading our laboratories. Uh, they are world-class facilities. Um, the people that are teaching the course are, are research active, which means that they are leaders within their field and they use that research knowledge in order to inform their teaching. And, and that, for me, is a, is, a, is a very real strength. We have over a thousand hectares of, of land, equine units and farms and so on. And in addition to that, we have uh, the, the National Library of Wales, which has every book published in the UK since 1911. It's also a beautiful, safe location and a lovely place to live. Students will learn how to use animals to best effect, that they will learn how to feed them so that they, they, they perform in the way that, that we want to in, in terms of dairy cows here or in terms of a horse or in terms of a companion animal, um, it, it, it's health. Students will learn how to, to make breeding choices so, so that the, the offspring of the animals are, 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 are of the type of animal that's required, how to um, monitor the behaviour of animals and, and to adapt the environment of animals so that their behaviour is appropriate and their welfare is, is maximised. We're, we're talking about animal nutrition, um, feeding them, animal breeding, um, selecting them for, for desired traits so, so that they, they do what we want of them. Um, the parasitology and the animal health and the immunology is also an important part of the course. Animal behaviour is also an important part of the course, measuring animal behaviour, predicting animal behaviour, managing their environment so, so that their behaviour is, is, is not compromised, thinking about animal welfare as well. Aberystwyth University has spent millions of pounds upgrading our laboratories. They are world-class facilities in terms of genomics or proteomics or transcriptomics. Um, we have world-class facilities in terms of animal nutrition, in terms of animal behaviour. We have world-class facilities uh, in, in terms of feeding a, a whole range of, 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 of animals. We have an equine unit, we have dairy cows here of course, um, we have sheep, we have beef animals and we have poultry as well and, and, and those facilities are available to the students alongside the laboratories as well. Our graduates become animal nutritionists for feed companies either for horses or for farm animals or for, for companion animals, pets. In the animal health industry, uh, developing veterinary products for, for all the, the range of animals that, that, that we're talking about. Genus and the like that, that are, are breeding companies, uh, again advising farmers or horse owners or whoever it is about, about breed choices um, f f for their animal holding. We insist that all of our students do two weeks of relevant work experience um, and, and that might be working alongside a nutritionist or, or alongside a vet or, or alongside a, a researcher or um, a, a animal breeding or, or whatever it is um, and that is done between the first year and the second year. The entry requirements are somewhere between 280 and 320 UCAS points. For students with three science A levels then we would ask 280 points, for two science A levels it would be 300 points and for just one science A level and that would have to be biology then it would be 320 points. The key part of the course is the final year dissertation where students have an opportunity to think up a, a, an experiment that involves animals to, to design that experiment so, so that it remains within the law and it's completely ethical to conduct the experiment, to, um, to collect the data, to, to do some statistics on the data and draw some conclusions and then to write the whole thing up as a, a, as a thesis and, and then that counts to be a, a large part of the course. This, this dissertation, which is usually done in the, the third year, but we get our students thinking about it from the second year, you would be supervised by a, a, a world-class researcher in the field who, who will uh, guide you in your studies, guide you in the experimentation and the design and so on and the conclusions drawn. And, and it, it's, it's a real chance for, for students to, to get to grips with animal science.